coming up on Junkin, Dave and I are in Helen, Germany. No, it's Georgia. Helen, Georgia. What? Yeah, it just looks like Germany. Okay, if you say so. Anyway, we're going to go to a really cool flea market. Woo. We're also going to take you to some local yard sales, and we're going to take you to this thing called a five-minute auction. they got stuff coming in and out so fast, you don't know if you're buying or selling. And just like always, you're going to have the opportunity to go home with some of this great stuff that we find, so stick around. Helen, Germany! It's Georgia. <laughs> okay! Welcome to Junkin. I'm Val Myers. And I'm Dave Bird. You know, it wasn't too many years ago, 1968, there was almost nothing here. Huh. A couple of businessmen were sitting around trying to decide how to get some tourism in the area. What'd they do? Well, they did the natural thing, Val. They decided to turn it into a Bavarian Alpine village. Oh, of course. They've got a lot of family attractions, some cool little shops, and some excellent places to eat. And a lot of tourists. Mm -hmm. I guess the business plan worked, right? Absolutely. <laughs> it's a great place to visit, but we're going to show you where the locals go to have fun. The flea market. Let's go. Okay. Today, we're visiting Henry's Mountain Flea Market. It's a few miles south of downtown Helen on Highway 129. Val, you can go ahead and shop. I'm just going to watch a little TV. All right. <laughs> That's awful pretty, I think. How much you want for this? For this? Two dollars. Two dollars. What do you think? Ooh, nice. Pretty, huh? This is cool. That's funny, like in the 60s, they're just like, I, I want a lighter and I'm gonna set it down. Yep. It's gonna be there when it's I come gonna, back. It's like doubles as a paperweight. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely not a shirt pocket model. No. Yeah. That's me, and that's Dave, because Dave said he's hiding. Yeah. And um, that is Dave's uh, crazy uncle. <laughs> and this is a guy we met on the train when we rode in. And this is, um, this is, Bill. What's your take on that? Oh, this is from uh, ancient Egypt. Uh, I think it's a Mesopotamian fertility uh, necklace, Dave. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> do you think these are old? Yeah, I do. How old do you, what era was this? I remember my mom had some of these. This been like the 60s or 70s? 50s. 50s even, okay. What do you get for these? Well, I was asking five dollars for all of them. For all of them? I like them because they have the little clamps, so you uh -huh. actually clamp metal and, and plastic to your head. Right. Just that whole concept. Yeah. Ah. Okay, it's lefty, loosey, righty, tighty. Ow, tidy. ow. How's that? It's like punishment for not getting your ears pierced. <laughs> like. Let's roll up. We're going to rock this joint. It's hey, hot. Okay. It's hot. That looks good, man. You look so good. You should totally wear that. <laughs> like if your grandma was punk rock. <laughs> grandma style. Dave, uh -huh. I've made another archaeological discovery today. Oh yeah, what'd you get? This is gonna blow your mind. Okay. Okay, check out this dinosaur here. It's giant. I, I think it dates back to the early, early uh, cellular lipic. Cellular uh, lipic period. Cellular, yeah. Cellular, yeah. Cellular, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I forgot what you guys said. This chair is. I'd like you to meet Mike Lance. He Hi. is the uh, master of this flea market. So, Mike, I love your flea market. Thank you. I love Thank it. You. Thank you. We've been working on it for a year and a half, so. A year and a half, that's it? Well, it's been here 15 years. The first one burnt down, so <gasps> oh, we've been working it on this one a year and a half. Wow, okay. Yeah. One thing I have to I have to ask you about right away, you have a lot of rules. I'm, I This is the most, you know, this is the tightest ship that I've ever seen in a flea market. Well, it's for the people. I mean, you know, if I don't have the rules here, my dealers don't take care of the people, you know, 
they're not gonna come. So yeah. I, I try to have good tight ship for the people. Yeah, and, it's nice. And, and, it's and really my nice. My dealers, they all oblige me. You have some like, kind of peculiar rules too. Uh, one of your rules is um, no snotting. How did you happen to have that rule? They, they just kind of, some of these country boys around here, they just kind of blow their nose anywhere they want to go. <laughs> <laughs> so we don't let them spit on our floors. We don't let them. Uh, Snot. Yeah, it's not on her. It's not on the floor. Or no like snotting no, on the no floors. No, no, no snotting on the that. floors. No, no swearing. No swearing. Uh, no alcohol. No alcohol. You My dad lot. used to say, he says, no matter what you got, it's how you take care of it. So yeah. It doesn't matter what we have here, as long as we take care of it, and make it look good for everybody. Is this yours? Yes. <laughs> okay. Mind telling me what it is? It's a French fry cutter. A French fry yes, cutter. Yes, French fries. You can put carrots, anything. Apples. So when you smash it down like that, it comes out. Oh, it out. comes out the end. Yes, that's why it's really best for French fries. What no fingers, just French fries. You got any potatoes? Yes, there's a fruit stand next door. Finish that? No. Okay. This is the little miniature sports dictionary. Where's trash talk? I can't find that one. <laughs> no trash talk. Um, no triple threat. What about, what about bring the heat? Is it in there? No. No high hard heat being thrown or. What about having game? No. 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 I don't even see skills. I don't see you got got skills. I don't see Bring It. It must be old. Where's Bring It? Yeah. Oh, here's Who Let the Dogs Out. Oh, okay. <laughs> Whew, okay, let's get it. <laughs> oh, you know, you were looking for a uh, snack and go smiley. Found one. Wow. Is this good? Yeah. I don't know anything about plates. Was this like worth something? It's worth around $35. Is it really? Yes. <laughs> What are you asking for it? Five. Well, if it's worth 35, why are you asking five? Nobody will give me 35. <laughs> really? Don't forget, everything we buy on Junkin' is available to you, our fellow junk enthusiasts. To get in on the action, all you have to do is go to www.turnersouth.com. From there, just follow the links to the Junkin' online auction. And now a little later, we'll show you some highlights from today's auction, but keep in mind, at any time, you can bid on items for upcoming shows. Now, coming up, it may be Henry's Flea Market by day, but at night, it's Henry's Auction House. Things can get pretty crazy on a Friday night here in Helen, Germany. I mean, Georgia. Dang it, Val. 